So this is my favorite piece of art. It was given to me by, oh, a pretty famous artist, I guess. I won't mention names because we're on YouTube. But I want to put this in a frame so that I can hang it in my kitchen because I think it would look really good there. So yesterday I went to the antique stores and I found this frame. I paid a lot for it. It was $2.50. I had to save for weeks. But I got this. And the picture doesn't exactly fit in the frame. But I like the blue and these blues together. I think it's going to be good. The frame came with this mat. And I'm figuring I can trim the mat. Like about that big. Around there. And then I can put the mat in the frame and the picture in the frame and I'll have a good picture for my kitchen. So I made some marks around here where I want to cut it and I got this straight edge and I'm going to set right on my pencil marks and I've got a real sharp razor blade and go run it across once Twice, a little bit every time. Okay. And that went through. So let's go ahead and do the next one. Each time it goes a little deeper, we're almost through. Oh, I can feel it going through. Deep. There we go. Got that one. One more. out let's see what we got over here oh that's out that's good we got to go through a little bit more here that's good come on okay got that let's see how that fits I'm going to grab the art. Funnest art money can buy. Okay, that looks good. And then the frame goes over it. That looks good. Now, I got a little bit of roughness here because I was cutting that cardboard with an old knife. So I'm going to grab a piece of sandpaper and just clean that up a little bit. So this is a little rough. I got this piece of sandpaper. I'm just real lightly going to hit that. And you see how that cleans that up? It makes it so nice. It makes me want to cry. And this is a pretty special piece of art. This is palm trees in Egypt. That's what I've named it. And I think the colors are really beautiful. that clean set up nice I got a little looks like I got a little fingerprint there let's see if we can make that go away too yeah of course blow it off yeah I think that looks pretty good let's see what we have here oh that's gonna be beautiful I'm gonna go ahead and put the back on it and we're going to go hang it up. So let's get the back on it here. I'm going to set this right here. And I don't know why this paper's here, but it's there. We're going to use it. And there's the back. Look how fancy it is. <laughs> Got these little clips. They hold everything in place.
think that's pretty good. Oh, but I'm silly. I got it upside down. That's the top, and I put the top up there. So I'm gonna take it apart and put the put it right side up. Oops. <laughs> That's the top because that's where the nail is on the wall and it hangs from the nail. There we go. So, yeah, that's the top of my art. My painting, palm trees in Egypt. <laughs> it's really not a painting, it's more a multimedia piece of art. Okay, there we go. A lot of clips. I like that. It's going to hold it together nicely. I'm so excited to see this on the wall because I know it's going to look good. I just think it's so pretty. Meh! Yeah, get in there. Go. Go around the other way then. There we go. Okay, it's there. Let's take a look. Dun, da, da, da. That's pretty dang good. I like that. Let's go hang it up. Wait, wait, don't look, don't look. <gasps> there it is, the best piece of art anybody's ever had. That looks pretty good in my kitchen, don't you think? <laughs>